Hi guys, it's Yanni from the Animized Competitions and tonight is the ultimate competition and we're live right here. We have a lawyer, we have three judges and someone hopefully is going to win big. big. You're right. Hi, how is everyone? Welcome back to Yanomai's Competitions and it is the ultimate competition. Let me just explain this to you guys from the start. So there's a picture with three people. We've got three judges here tonight and a lawyer to make sure everything is correct and you have to see where the coin is and pick. Now, if someone that played for the seven and a half thousand pound gets closest to the coin, they will win that seven and a half thousand pounds. However, if someone that played for a Rolex or for an Aorus or for a BMW or for 10,000 pound cash and they get closest to the coin, they win the prize. So whatever prize we give away tonight is the person that gets closest to the coin. So we could give away anything. It could be a watch, could be money, could be a car, could be a holiday, could be a bundle. We don't know what we're gonna give away until the judges pick. Right, let's get the judges. Let's do this. Right, let me bring in the judges. First up is Dan. You might recognize this from my house updates. Dan, come in, introduce yourself to the guys at home, please. Hi there, my name's Dan from Airwave AV and I do home cinemas and Yanni's house. You do, and you're here tonight. Yeah. You gotta pick where the coin is. Yep. Okay, good luck. Let me bring the next person in. Also, if you follow me, you might recognize this man. He's not the Milky Bar kid, by the way. Oh. Uh, <laughs> any legal Edwards? Uh, I'm Neil, I'm from Insanity Group, uh, which is a management company that Yanni cited. That's it, so that is Neil Ransom. Obviously, you've got to have a lady, and this lady, she's very colourful, she's quite out there. We've got the lovely Jolie. Hi, Jolie. Hello, I am Jolie Sharp, I am a content creator and a presenter. You've got two men here, do you think you're going to control it up there? I'm very much in charge. I think we, we, we've come to a mutual agreement that I'm in charge. I thought you'd be in charge. So that is Jolie, that is Dan, and that is Neil. Obviously, we have our lawyer. So for the last month, we had George, who was the boss. George is back in Cyprus, and Ninos is back. Ninos, welcome back, my friend. Thank you, thanks, Yanni. Had to make sure I had to come back and oversee the process. Sorry, George. <laughs> Um, I am the lawyer for Yanomai's Competitions. Um, I'm a lawyer at Spectre, Constant & Williams in central London. Thank you, Ninos. Right, so I'm going to send these guys upstairs. Good luck. Find the coin. Right, let's see what's going on. Right, so Neil, Jolie, Ninos, and Dan. Should we get, I'm going to get the colours out. Jolie just stepped in. I'm in charge. I'm the boss here. Should we go for that first? Yeah. Then we'll go for Andre. Right. Oh, right. There's his eye. Now, where are we pointing that? Just move that a little bit further. Yanni is looking there. Mm. Bert's kind of looking there, I'd say that's perfectly placed. Yeah. I do say so myself. <laughs> I mean, she's definitely running this. Yeah. yeah. I'm winning 50k. Wow. A lot of people are saying 50k tonight. Is that what I'm giving away tonight? Yeah. I hope not. <laughs> no joke. It is what it is. I'm thinking neither of these are going to match with Bert. No, but it's only to give us a yeah, rough no. guide of where. We're not, we're not rough. We are going to do this. Precise. Precisely. We're going to become okay. experts at coin spotting. I think it could be maybe a tad higher than that. Okay, let's just sit, because yeah. we can always take that back. So we don't know what we're giving away. I will find out once they've picked the coordinate, and whoever's got close to the coin, it's gonna be one of, I think, 75 or 76 prizes. It could be anything, so just bear that in mind. Where are we going for here? I know, up there, I think that's bang on there. Well. Yeah, and then we can, it's there somewhere. Right, there's seven minutes 30 left. Okay, if we all like sit back, and like look and examine. <laughs> Very precise, you're all laughing. See how quick we are. I'm trying to get people the, the best prize here. I'm a, I'm a people's person, you know. I think you need a megaphone to tell them to hurry up. Simulate. Two minutes, okay, guys, 20! You know Look, I'll, I'll go with you. No, no, if you want to. No, no, no. We've still got time. Now I'm looking at it. I'm just trying to embody <laughs> myself as Andrew Burt and Yanni, thinking that could be right. How am I doing? Look like, look like them. Yes? You're oh, happy? God. Yeah, I'm, I'm good with that I'm, I'm yeah. happy with that. Okay, we're yeah, happy. It's done, they've chose. Someone is going to win tonight. What are we giving away? So this is where Bert, Bav and Ninos, they type it all in the computer and we find out, well, they find out for the first time what someone has won. I always say, keep an eye on their faces. If it's an Aurus, they might be like this. If it's five grand, they're going to be like, ah. Give me my sound effects. Um, Yanni, do you support people who are in need? Yes, I'm an ambassador for Razor Sunshine, best charity for me on the planet. Um, grants wishes to terminally ill children. So, yes. Uh-oh. What's going on? What's going on? Um, Yanni, we have a tie-break situation. Oh, first time! Winners, and um, they have picked the same coordinates. So we are going to give you the details of the two winners to put in the ball machine. Oh. 
We need to get the ball machine ready. I ain't gonna lie. I've never thought I'd have to use the ball machine. I don't know how to work it. <laughs> Everyone's saying let both win. Can't let both win because they might have played for different prizes. One might have played for five thousand pounds. The other one might have played for an Aurus. How can you? How can you let both win? <sighs> oh, this is mad. This is this is the rules. The rules are the rules. All runners up get five hundred pound each. The top ten closest get five hundred pound each. The ball machine working. I hope so. Should we test it? Oh, hey! Let's see. And the lottery, it could be you. I get way too carried away, don't I? Here come the judges. All right, come in, guys. Jolie, how was that? It was, it was fun. We did a good job, I think. It's the first time we've ever had two winners. So I've had to bring out the ball machine. There's going to be one winner, and the nine other, or the ten other runners up will all get £500 each. What's going on? They're coming down. Um, thank you, judges. Thank you, judges. Here they come. So here we go. Oh my God. <laughs> I, don't know what to, I actually don't know what to do. So, right, so I've got, this is Ninos. Hi, Ninos. Hi, Annie. Right, so Ninos, tell me what you've got in your hands. Uh, this is the ultimate competition winner. Uh, then we've got the ultimate competition winner number two. So one of these two will win tonight. And what's that? And then here are your runner-ups. Okay, so let's quickly do the runners-up. I'm nervous. This is from third place down to 10. If, you're, if your name is read out now, um, you've won 500 pounds. You got really close, unlucky, but you won 500 pounds. Paul Drury, Deepak Vasani, Francis Odejinami, Christopher Piercy, Jason Cuddington, Zane Mushi, Munshi, JS Deventure, Red One Khan, Imran Khalib. You have all won 500 pounds each. You didn't win, but you were third to 10th. So guys, let me just make this clear. I have two people that got the same coordinates and they are both theoretically winners at this point, right? We can't have two winners, there can only be one winner. So what I've done, I've got ball one for envelope one and ball two for envelope two. I'm gonna put both the two balls in here. Whichever ball comes out is the winner of tonight's ultimate competition. The person that didn't win, I will read out your name and you will win 500 pounds. First time, the machine. Right, good luck. Just the one. Oh my God. The thing is, we don't know, because we don't know who the winner is. Oh my God. <laughs> and it is, where's the ball? Number two. Let me show you. Number two. Right, well, I'm gonna open number one up, just to say the name, so you know you've won 500 pounds, okay? <sighs> the runner up, who's won 500 pounds is Biraj Gurung. You've won 500 pounds. Congratulations. You were so close. Oh my God, you were so close. And the winner, ready? I'm just looking at the comments. This is a great prize. You ready? It's right, I'm ringing the person now. Let's see if they're on the live. Turn the volume up. Usually, if they're on the live, they answer quick. Hello. Hi, is that Owen? It is, yeah. Owen, hi. Do you know who this is? I don't. Uh, Are you driving? I am, yeah. Would you mind pulling over? I need to FaceTime you. Okay. Uh, just give me a second. Oh, I think I recognise the voice, actually. Do you? Who's the voice? <laughs> it sounds like Yanni. It is Yanni. You need to pull over, my friend, because I need to call you. Oh, my God. I can't believe this. <laughs> believe it. Yeah, oh, there he is. Look at the face. Oh, look at him in his little tie as well, mate. How are you? Yeah, work. I'm not too bad. So what do you do for a living? No, I work in finance. You're looking for work in finance, yeah? What sort of prize have you played for on the ultimate competition? I uh, played for cars, motorbikes. Um, I can't, can't remember what else, to be honest. I can't remember. Right, do you want to know what you've won? I'd like to know. That'd be great. You ready? Here's what he's won. Two and a half thousand pounds. Yay. <laughs> and a Ducati motorbike. I need to get my motorbike license then. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's incredible. I can't believe that. That's ridiculous. Congratulations, Owen! <laughs> Has it sunk in yet? Thank you very much. I don't think so, no. <laughs> The guys will contact you in a race to work out how we're going to sort it out, get you your bike and your money and everything else, okay? But well done, congratulations, my friend. That's incredible, I can't believe it. <laughs>
Thanks very much. See you later. Bye bye. Bye. Obviously, I've got to give away the PS5 tonight as well. And the winner of the PS5, I'm going to ring this person tonight. Can you get me that phone number? Is Coral Lee. You have just won the PS5 tonight. Hi, is that Coral? Yeah. Hi, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. Who's this? Um, it's a guy called Yanni. Shut up, Yanni. You shut up, Coral. No way. Yes way, Coral. Oh my God, no way. Let's FaceTime you so you can actually say, shut up, Yanni. Hi, Coral, how are you? Oh my God. I can't believe you're ringing me. Oh my God. What... Have you been playing the competition? Yeah. What have you played for? I played for the, the, the cash, the free entry, and I played for something else. Do you want to see what you won? Yeah, go on then. You've won a PS5. Oh, amazing. Thank you so much. <laughs> Is the PS5 for you or you're going to give it to someone? Do you know what? I might gift it to my partner. Oh, that's nice. Oh, everyone. Oh. The team will contact you and arrange to send you the prize, okay? Oh, thank you so much, Danny. Take care. See you later. Bye. <laughs> Do you know what? Can we not sell out something else I can give away today? Okay, there's 500 pound credit. Here's the winner for the 500 pound credit. Can we get that person's phone number? And the winner is Hassan Khan. Has he won before? Hassan Khan. What's he won before? Tell me. He's won credit before. No way. He's not, is he going to answer? He's not going to answer. If he doesn't answer, I'm signing off, guys. Hassan's not answering. So that was crazy tonight. First time we ever had two uh, winners. Um, unbelievable. The main winner won. A Ducati and two and a half thousand pounds. The second one won 500 pounds as a run up credit along with eight other people. It's fun. We'll be back again for Ready Set Play. Thank you for watching. Um, my name is Jolie Sharp. I am a content creator and a presenter. It was super, super fun. I had two great people doing it with me. Very, very fair. And I encourage you all to join in and play. Yanni was great doing the live. I don't know how he talks for an hour straight. It's, it's super impressive. Um, and it's really, really engaging and great to watch. I'll definitely be tuning in for the next one. Hi, my name's Dan from Airwave AV and we install home cinemas and smart homes. So there was two people who were in the frame and there was a tiebreaker situation, so that was cool to watch. And yeah, it was just a cool experience. Congratulations to the main winner and all the runners up who took part and good luck for the next one. Uh, my name's Neil, I work for a company called Insanity Group. It was my first time being a judge today. I thought it was uh, really exciting. It's uh, really exciting when you're here in person because you can feel the adrenaline in the room especially when Yanni is announcing the winners because you can see that he's genuinely excited by it as well. And I think that, you know, the, the contagious atmosphere kind of travels through the building. So yeah, it's, it's good fun. Uh, Ninos Simon, I am a lawyer at Spectre Constant Williams. First time we've had to use the uh, ball machine. So it was the first time I've had to oversee that process as well. Very straightforward. Um, Yanni put in the two balls into the machine, pressed the button and automatically um, one, one outcome, one winner. Very fair. Um, I think it's the right thing to do. Really, really pleased with the outcome.